Oh, hello. This is Mitchell from J Manning Channel. I'm bringing a tutorial on rigid to soft body shapes. Just fun bouncing stuff. Um, we start out with as a floor. Just get a floor. Go to simulation, dynamics, create collider. Okay. Um, might as well just make a material for it. Just a bright white. Now you want to get a sphere and drag it up. <laughs> drag it up, make it as big as you want. And bring up the segments to about 35. Uncheck render perfect so you don't forget later on. Click on the sphere, go to simulation, dynamics, create rigid body. And this will pop up. Collision, make sure the balance is on like, I'll put it up to 150. Now if you see me play it, sort of bounces, you know. Um, let's bump it up to like 275. And now it really bounces. Actually, that's higher. <laughs> um, drag it down to 190, let's try that. That seems fine. If you want like a bigger bounce, just drag it up and zoom out. Now when you play it, pretty good bounce right there. I'll, I'll bump it up to 200 just to put it as a good number. That's fine. Bring up your frames, of course. I'll put it. I'm gonna make a 10 second video for this. Okay. Then sphere, um, click on its rigid body tag, and then go over here to soft body. Um, what you want to do is drag to where you might want. Just play it. Um, bounce once, twice, three, and then right here at 145, I'll have it off. Click on soft body, click s control, and click that box, and it'll become red. I mean, you set a keyframe, and then at 150, I will change it to made of polygons and lines. And then keyframe that. And now let's watch. So it bounces once, bounces twice, bounces again, and then lag. And then, as you can see, gelatin. Gelatin form. Okay. Basic right there. And then, say you want more of them. Just click on sphere, click control C, control V. And control V again for more. I'll move this one over here. And I'll move this one over here. So now we have three of them. We can all we can put them to different heights, you know, so they're not all the same. Actually, I'll zoom out a little bit and put this one even higher. Now, as you can see, they all bounce together, and then goes to lag. Just because it's going to go to gelatin soon. Let it play. Sorry about this. And I can see the first one hitting is gelatin. And then the second one hitting is about to be gelatin. Okay, gelatin. Now if we render that... It looks like that. They look like raindrops, you could say, pretty much. So, that's basic right there. So, of course, I want to add, you know, some... I'm going to make a nice black texture for it. Reflection, drag it down. But for now... There you go.
Then we're gonna make a background and drag the exact same color from the floor to the background. And then click on floor, right click, Cinema 4D tags, compositing. And then unclick self shadowing and click compositing background. Now as you can see it's just full white and sexy. If we were to untake compositing background, unclick that and put that on, that this is what it'll look like, ugly gray. But when we click compositing background, it's a sexy white. So I mean just for me, I'm just gonna add um, a little bit of a gray gorilla scale from acres. Gray gorilla scale. Now if we restart it, let's see where they are. Looks pretty good right there. Now when we do this, some nice sexy reflections. Then render settings, well, I'm going to show you those. Um, full render, output to film and video to HD TV 720.29.97. All frames, save as either AVI, but I have QuickTime, so I save as QuickTime Movie. I'll save it as, in my videos, as Bounce. Bouncy tut. <laughs> bouncy tit. Bouncy tut. And then anti aliasing, make sure it's on best for animation. Options, change that down to 6 and this to 2. And you're good. Now, what I do is just watch where the balls. <laughs> watch where the. Those spheres go. And make sure that they don't go past that black line, so they don't for right now they're still not then they go one more and of course lag and they don't look like they're gonna go out of the line so I'll just end this at like 200 frames and there you go, basic bouncy, um, rigid to soft body tutorial. Thank you for watching. Please comment, rate, and subscribe. Thank you for thank you.